look at me Hello everyone, it is Lynn again. I am back. I spent the entire morning cleaning my apartment and welcome to another let's get my life and shit together video because I am leaving for Japan for two weeks this Saturday, which is tomorrow. And I hate leaving my home in disarray when I'm traveling for a long time and I want it to be a nice clean place for Kayla and stuff while I'm away. I do have a friend coming in to check in on her and my plants, but there's a lot to do okay because i don't know what happened with january and february but now it's march so that means one my semester is about to end i have a month and a half left to work on my thesis i need to file my taxes so i gotta sort out some of those documents before i leave i need to finish tidying up the home i have a dance practice today in an hour and a half i have errands to run there are still things i need to buy for japan i have this lovely to-do list in my planner and on notion to help me tackle all my tasks before i leave the country and I've been learning to make the most out of my planning and productivity tools thanks to Skillshare, the sponsor of today's video. I have been working with Skillshare since high school and now I'm about to graduate college very full circle. And in case you don't know, Skillshare is the largest online learning community. And currently I have been trying to upgrade my Notion. I've been using Notion since I started college and it's been mostly for keeping track of my assignments and my busy schedule. But now that I'm about to, you know, head on into the workforce or whatever and full send with adulting, I am trying to change my Notion templates to fit my life post-grad. So this learning path called Supercharge Your Productivity with Notion has been really great for venturing out and trying new methods of digital planning. In this learning path, there are multiple folks who specialize in specific topics. I really like this one by Max called UX Design Portfolios with Notion, including templates. And this one is a bit more on the nose, but as a YouTuber, Asante's class, Notion for YouTube Creators, Easily Manage Your Creative Projects, has helped me wrangle my video planning and shooting process and my social media posts. Skillshare is built for learning so there are no ads and they're always launching new premium classes and they have everything you need to take your passion projects and side hustles into your main hustle. So if you would like the first 500 to click the link in the description box will get a one month free trial of Skillshare. Thank you so much to Skillshare for sponsoring this video. Okay I'm gonna go run errands right now and pick up those necessities and then I'm gonna take you along with me to dance practice on campus. So let's go there's so many things to do. from my errands. It was successful. And I'm gonna quickly go over some things that I got. I think I'm finally confronting the fact that I have a ginormous sweet tooth. So for the road, I got my favorite sour candy, which are the horrible twin snakes, and then the trolley sour gummy worm. To do some more cleaning, some bleach for the bathroom. My favorite hairspray, but the travel size friendly version. Travel size Clorox wipes, toothbrush, pimple patches, and then me, AKA a lint roller. Get it? Lint, trong, lint roll cat owner things and lastly i picked up my mail from the package room and i got a battery charger in the mail it's for my nikon coolpix square camera which i'm so excited to use in japan and now we're gonna go to campus and do some dancey dance dance practice <laughs>
I'm super duper hungry and I need to clean out my fridge before I leave. So today's dinner was not the most coordinated. I stir fried some beef, onions, added some seasoning, and I made some ramen because I don't want to cook any more rice. I have some leftover napa, which is just steamed. I <laughs> had cut down to the stems, so I mostly just have stems. And then I have some pickled daikon that has been in my fridge for a while. I mean, just finally finished it out. Bon appetit! I'm so excited! <laughs> Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mmm, mmm. I seasoned that so well, I didn't even taste. I don't make meat that often, also because it's expensive compared to eating eggs and tofu and stuff. But I always surprise myself when my meat does turn out well. Mmm, so yummy. <laughs> 